Hello friends, if you are not subscribed my channel, please subscribe my channel. My channel name is Real Life Indrajit Pal. Please subscribe my channel and press the bell icon for more updated video. Today, our discussing topic is power transformer protection circuit. It is a very important for substation power plant and wherever you want to install the power transformer so today our discussing topic is the three most important relay that has three coil individually and protect the transformers internal fault by incipient fault inside the transformers so we use here the three relay one is the tripping relay one is the alarm relay and another is also the tripping and alarm relay it is installed in the control room panel it's called control and relay panel back side of the transformers panel we are using this three relay for transformers internal for protection this is the dc dc supply provided from the dc <coughs> dc db this dc supply is provided from the dc db we are giving the negative negative is the k2 to every relay we are giving the negative to the every relay and the positive supply is giving to the marceline box of the power transformers x1 tb x1 and x2 tb x1 tb is used for the protection and the supply of the transformers and x2 tb is used for the supply to the cooling system uh, that is the cooling fan pump lightning purpose lighting purpose etc auxiliary supply purpose we are using from the x2 tb and x1 is x1 tb is very important for getting the three phase supply providing the ltc supply um, tap changing supply and uh, the all the protection issue is just attached with this tb okay and now we are discussing about the power transformer uh, this is a uh, pictorial representations uh, a power transformer this is the marceline box wti winding temperature indicator uh, for hv high voltage side winding temperature indicator for low voltage side and oti the oil temperature indicators this uh, these three um, temperature indicators are attached with the marceline box and this tv is connected uh, with the um, uh, internal connection from internal connection of the wti oti uh, buchholz relay uh, osr uh, prv and all the connections all the connections is connected to this tb and this uh, buchholz relay osr prv wti oti i uh, have the ano contact inside their terminal so this this connection actually uh, this outing terminal is this this wti and inside the uh, inside the wti this no contact is present for the alarm and it's also for the um, trip also trip and alarm we are using this no contact inside the wti inside the oti inside the prv inside the osr inside the buchholz relay um, and uh, um, whatever protections you are providing all inside protections is the no contact so now we are connecting now we are uh, connecting this uh, supply already we are uh, providing this negative to the every relay and we are now connecting this and connecting to this terminal for the wti for the wti alarm if uh, this no contact converted to the nc or uh, the contact is made so the positive is uh, positive is coming from here k1 and this positive is uh, just if this is a 
if this is uh, the nc contact then the positive is uh, back from this path and this uh, relay will be uh, this coil will be energized so uh, the operators of the from the control room um, uh, can uh, understand that the wti trip for the wti trip the transformers uh, is tripped and in case of the wti buckles oti alarm wti alarm buckles alarm osr moj prv all the path is same the positive is just sorting here and the positive is back from the another part after getting no contact to nc contact so friend today our topic is very important uh, please remember this topic for the protection issue of the transformers thank you for watching my video please subscribe my channel